Good morning. Happy Friday. Friday, Friday. How are you? Welcome to class. Let me get the other thing going here. This is your 16 week yoga class. I'm so happy to see you. Hey, hey, hey. Quiet. We're not having any of that today. No barking. Chance is excited. It's Friday, too. Hi, Carol. You made it. You got done with your stuff you were doing. I'm so glad. All right, let me fix this. Here we go. Here we go. A little bit better. Yes. Happy Friday. Happy to see you this morning. This is your 60 minute yoga class. I'm just going to turn on the YouTube live. Give me a minute over here. Hi, Stephen. Welcome. 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 I'm happy to see you on Strava, Stephen. It's very motivating that Strava. I really like it. Okay. Let's see. Keep track of your calories, your workouts, tag your friends. It's fun. All right, welcome to class, 60 minute yoga class today. We do everything twice. If you don't get it the first time, you get a second chance. Awesome, awesome. Let's see, where is this? Here we go, all right. Perfect. All right, welcome, welcome Andre, how are you? So we are trying YouTube Live today too. Perfect, there we go. So I know that when we did the live the other day on YouTube, there was a big, there was a lot of people on there. It actually kind of looks like a better picture over there on YouTube. I don't know if you have YouTube Live if you want to try that one. So uh, let's see, here we go, get on the right Wi-Fi. All right, so welcome to class everybody. 60 minute yoga class today. Uh, it is hot yoga that we're doing. You don't have to do it hot though. It's totally up to you. It's your yoga room, so you can turn up the heat as much as you like. You can turn. You don't have to have any heat if you don't want to. I do have some heaters going back here. I've got that big one. I stand next to that during the standing series. And then I get the little one and the humidifier back there. I want to thank Doris and Alex for sending me those, the collage back there from Alex and the, uh, Painting there from Doris. So nice, you guys. You spoil me. Spoil your yoga teacher. <laughs> really, really nice. So these classes are free. They are for everybody, everybody. If you are interested in giving me a tip, which some of you have, and so keep asking me why I don't tell you, so I want to tell you. Uh, hi, Doris. Welcome. I was just showing your picture back there in the back, how it's so pretty. I got to get my husband to hang it up for me. Um, but my Venmo is uh, Amy Lynn McNulty, those of you that are asking. It is not required, it's not expected, it's just um, some of you asking me, so I just want to tell you, hi Janie, good morning, you're here at the beginning today, you're going to do some yoga with me, I hope so. We're streaming live today on Facebook Live and also on the YouTube Live, we're going to try that. We've got about nine minutes left, so if you're watching this on the recording, you can go ahead and jump ahead. We do this Monday, Wednesday, excuse me, not Monday, not Wednesday, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, 9 a.m. I think we're gonna keep this schedule. I like it. I hope you like it. I haven't heard, but uh, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday works good. 9 a.m. Pacific. If you can't make it to the live class, the recordings are always on my, hi Kimberly, are always on my YouTube channel, Amy Lynn McNulty. And uh, you can stream anytime. You can do a, go do redo a class if you like. Let me just take this. I just did my run to warm up. I'm going to take my vitamin C. Do you guys take these? The emergencies? Yeah? Real quick. Shoot it like a pixie stick. Yeah? Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Mmm. So good. If you've never tried it like that, you should try it. It's really good. It gives you a little bit of sugar going on here in the morning. So anyways, welcome. Welcome to your Friday morning yoga class. I'm so happy you're here. We're doing this Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, this week. Next week, let's keep the same. Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, 9 a.m. I might sneak in a couple little, because what I usually do on those other days, hi, Martin, um, that I'm not doing the yoga class with you guys. I do do a little bit maybe like a 30 minute class by myself. So I'm thinking it won't be scheduled or anything like that. I'll record it and put it on the YouTube just so you have a little, um, just a little yoga surprise maybe, a yoga snack, quick little run through class. 
you know, if you want to. If not, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, we're doing 60 Minutes Yoga, 9 a.m. Pacific. Hi, Hitomi, welcome, welcome. Also, Kimberly, she's here on here, is doing a 90 minute, are you doing it next week too, Kimberly, Tuesday, Thursday? 90 minute class, 9 a.m. Pacific on her Facebook, Kimberly Reed. I don't know if you're, I don't think you're on Instagram anymore, right? Instagram feed's not really good for um, doing yoga class, you know? So um, anyways, yeah, so if you're looking for a 90 minute class, I know lots of you um, send me messages about when are you gonna do the 90 minute class? Well, I really prefer the 60 minute class. <laughs> so, okay, so there you go. So you could do Tuesday with Kimberly, Wednesday with me, Thursday with Kimberly, Friday with me, and then Sunday fun day, we do again, 9 a.m. Pacific. Uh, yeah, so I'm, I appreciate each and every one of you. Hi, Erin, thank you for sharing this. Oh good, Facebook Live only, okay. So hi, Maggie, welcome, welcome. I appreciate all of you joining me. I appreciate you sharing this class. Share this with everybody you know. Free yoga for everybody. I am going to continue doing this even after the yoga studio opens. I know that we're doing this from a distance. Hi, Helen. But I actually feel a lot more connected to you than I do when I'm teaching in the yoga studio. So I'm gonna keep doing it like this and we'll just see how it goes. And um, we get to reach a lot more people this way. I mean, we have people all around the world doing this class with us. Yoga is kind of like an international language. You know, everybody does yoga, some form of yoga, something. You can do something. You can do a little bit in this class. Even if it's your first time, even if you've got lots of injuries, even if you're, you say, I'm too old, you're never too old. You can do something in this yoga. Some of you do it in a chair. That's fine. You do the arms. You get your body moving. Hi, Sally. Welcome to class. Hi, Aki. Yeah. How are you this morning? Happy Friday. Happy you're here. Happy you're joining me. I'm happy you're sharing this class. Share this with everybody you know. I was just saying, everybody can do a little bit of this yoga. You can send them the recording on YouTube. And all of this time right now affecting people in different ways. I'm sure you know you're experiencing this and you're experiencing maybe different than your person. Hi, baby, good morning. I know I was long-winded in my message to you yesterday. <laughs> I apologize if that was TMI, but um, I just wanna thank you guys. I really do appreciate each and every one of you for being here. You have helped me to get through this time. You've given me a purpose. You've made me feel connected. I've never ever felt alone. I have always felt like you guys are right there for me and I hope that you feel the same. So Friday, got, hi Shoku, good morning. Got big plans for the weekend. It looks like it's gonna be nice here in Vegas. I think it's already in the 70s. It's gonna be in the 90s today. Chance, our little yoga buddy, he's back there. He's in his savasana already, ran through the sprinklers this morning. Happy Friday, yogis, Helen. Yes, happy to see you here. We got about four minutes left. So what's going on? You got your mat, you got your towel. You don't need a mat and towel. If you have one, that's great. If you don't have one, that's great too. You don't even need it. Hi, Stephen, Lisa, good morning. Um, you just need your space. You need your good attitude. Oh good, I'm so happy, Maggie, wonderful. Welcome, welcome. So if you have your mat and towel, that's great. If not, you don't need it. You just need your space, your good attitude, your happy smiling face, and just, you're gonna try. Whatever you do today, there's no judgment, there's no competition. You're in this for you, you're getting a benefit. Hi Rob, anything that you're doing, hi Rivai, good morning. Anything that you're doing in the class, you're getting a benefit from it. So you just try your best, you do a little bit especially in the beginning. There's no reason to kill yourself in one day and then never be able to practice again and say, oh my God, Amy killed me in that yoga class. Hi, Rosa. Good morning. Happy Friday. Welcome, welcome. Vegas in the house today. How are we doing? I did my run this morning to warm up. If you did something to warm up good, you could take a shower, hot shower, walk the dogs, uh, Get in the hot tub, I thought about doing that too, warming up the body, because it's just easier. The reason we warm up, the reason we heat the class is it's easier for your body to be able to shave, to be able to move when it's warmed up. The muscles, it's like the steel factory. Your body is hard like the steel. They heat up the steel so you can bend the steel. So same thing, your body is the steel factory. You don't need it. I know a lot of us are intimidated by the heat, 
You don't want the heat? Oh my God, get me out of there. I know. Good morning, Meechin. Not Meechin. Meechin loves the heat right under the humidifier. I know. So hi, Joanna. Welcome. Um, if you have the heat, that's great. If you have a little bit of heat, if you don't, it doesn't even matter. Hi, Joyce. Welcome, welcome. All the way from Singapore. Happy to see you this morning. Good to do some yoga with me today, I hope. Yeah. Good morning, Alex. Welcome to class. Welcome, welcome. Happy to see you. Happy Friday, everybody. We are on my YouTube Live, if you want to try that out. The camera actually looks pretty good over there, so I don't know. You'll have to let me know how the stream is. Um, so we have it on YouTube Live and on my Facebook Live and uh, 60 Minutes of Yoga class. I want to make one quick announcement. Next week will be the same schedule. Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, 9 a.m. Pacific. If you missed the live, you can always do the um, recording. Oh, it's 12 a.m., Joyce. I'm so happy that you're here joining me live. I know the recordings are not the same, I know. The live is very motivating, so I'm happy you're here because it makes it feel like we're all in it together. Even though I can't see you, you're more motivated to never give up because you feel like I can see you, I know. All right, so let's get started, everybody. Let me fix this camera a little bit. I don't know why we look a little out of focus today. Let me see when we stand up. All right, quick sip. It's nine o'clock on the dot, everybody. Cheers. Let's stand up. Come to the middle of your space. If you have a mat and towel, set the towel right over the top of the mat. It's gonna help you. You're gonna get a little bit sweaty, maybe. So you don't want your mat to turn into a slip and slide. Mine's already sweaty from my sit ups this morning. All right, so come to the middle of your space. Toes and heels together. Welcome, Kiki. How are you? I'm so happy, Joyce. Welcome, Chloe. We got the yoga dogs here too today. Toes and heels together. Take a moment. Ground yourself. Bring yourself into this space. Shoulders back, chest up. Take a moment. This 60 minutes is all about you. Open eye movement meditation. I'm going to tell you exactly what to do, when to do, how to do. You listen, you follow along, you do what you can. Over time, you won't even need to see me anymore. I will just become a voice in the back of the head. So you don't even need to worry. Oh, mental yoga. That's okay, Joyce. I got it. You can always hit it on the YouTube live, so you don't have to, the YouTube channel, so you don't have to stay up till midnight over there in Singapore. But I appreciate you joining me. Welcome, Ben. And you begin with Pranayana, be breathing good for lungs and respiratory system. Breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. All the time you see your throat. Welcome, Deb. Breathe as much as possible, as long as possible, as slow as possible. My first timers, you can watch the first couple. Join in as soon as you have it. Smiling, happy face, shoulders back, chest up. Happy Friday, everybody. I'm Amy. I'm coming to you live from my backyard, Lake Las Vegas. Let's begin. Hi, Carmen. Interlock the ten fingers. Place your knuckles under the chin. Glue the knuckles to the chin. Nice tight grip. Concentrate, meditate, bring your body weight to your heels, stomach in. Inhale and begin, please. Stretch your elbows all the way up toward the ceiling. Stomach in, full lungs. Exhale, head out. Eyes open, mouth open, way back. Keep the spine straight. Bring your wrists together, forearms together. Push it out, elbows up. Inhale, from the side, looks like this. Stomach, stomach, stomach. Suck it in, tightening up. Pull it in, full lungs. Exhale, head up, head back. Open the mouth wide. Ha ha sound. Hey, grip. Relax your shoulders. Empty your lungs. Elbow stop. Inhale. Slowly bring the chin down. First timers, come on. Join me. Get off the couch. Out of the bed. Stretch up, stretch up, stretch up. Exhale. Head up. Welcome, Terry. Welcome, welcome. Tight grip. All ten fingers in your left position. Feel it in the back of the neck. Shoulders. Elbows stop. Inhale. Use your throat. Snoring sound. Vibration in the back of the throat. Chin comes down. Hands, palms face the floor. Full love. Head back, keep the spine straight. Make sure you're not dumping in the lower back. You know who you are. Spine straight, hips forward a little bit. Head muscles nice, tight, contracted. Elbows up. Inhale, one, two, bring your chin down, three, four, stretch your elbows up, five, six, full lungs. Exhale, head up. Use the full six count, synchronizing your arms and head movement. Only can move in your arms, your head, your breath, head back more. Elbows up. Inhale. Challenge yourself, expanding your lungs. 
Exhale, head up, head back. Completely empty the lungs on the exhale. Make room for the next breath. Challenge yourself. Push it out, push it out, push it out. Elbows touch. Inhale. Good. That's the sound. Nice, Tracy. Fresh air. New life. Oxygen coming in. Hold it. Exhale, head up. Completely empty your lungs. Keep going. When you think your lungs are empty, they're not. Push it out one more time. Elbows touch. Inhale. Let's do two more. These are the deepest breaths so far. Challenge yourself. Stomach, stomach, stomach. Suck it in. Tightening up. Full load. Exhale. Head up. Head back. Completely empty your lungs this time. Get everything out. Make yourself busy. Make room for the last one. Elbows touch. Inhale. Bring the chin down parallel to the floor. Stomach in. Suck it in. Tightening up. Hold it in. One more sip. Hold it. Exhale, head up. Nice and soft. Right into it. Get everything out. Hold on to nothing. Anything you're thinking about, worrying about, let it go. Elbows touch. And that's enough. Arms down by your side. Toes and heels together. You start with half moon pose with hands. You pose arch and dress enough. With Padahasthasana, everybody together. Welcome, Chuck. Inhale, hands up. Over the head. Interlock your chin fingers. Release the index fingers. Thumbs cross, stretch up. Right and left several times. Right and left. Right and left. You should feel stretching down both sides of your body, all the way up to your fingertips. In other words, you're trying to touch the ceiling, right, left, right, left. When you can't stretch any more, then please stop in the middle. Chin up, elbows lock. No gap between biceps, arms, and ears. Push your hips forward. Lay your upper body back, stretch out. Take a deep breath, full of the absolute straight line, slowly you push your body to the right. It's quick. We only have 60 minutes together. Use this time wisely. Push your hips to the left. Watch your hips carve in. Push your hips to the left beyond your flexibility. Feel the tremendous stretching feeling down the left side of your body. All over its head out. Bones to the skin. Fingertips to your toes. Bring your chin up, chin up, chin up. Arms with the ears. Hands, palms together. Chuck, bring your body down and push. When Stephen lays the hips forward, upper body back. Leg muscles, nice side contracted. Come down, push. Left hip forward. Make sure two hips in one line pointing forward. Right shoulder forward. Open up the chest. Flower petal blooming. Chin up. Make sure you're not resting your head on the body. Bicep, time to wake up, Emily. Use the right arm, pull the left arm down. Inhale, come down, push, come down, push, come down, push, come down, push. Inhale, breathing, come up. Hips forward, stretch up. Take a deep breath. Absolutely straight line, so we're going to rise to the left. Up and over, feel the stretch down the right side. Chin up, long neck visible in the front here. Body weight to your heels, leg muscles, nice side contracted, hands, palms together. Bring your right hip forward this time, two hips with one line. Left shoulder forward, no twisting, no turning, no collapsing. Feel the stretch down the right side, all over his head out. Chin up, smiling, happy face, take a deep breath, push, come down, push, keep going, come on, push, 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 push. Beautiful. First back for bed of the day. Your back's gonna hurt. Don't be scared. I'm gonna turn to the side, take a deep breath. Pull up and drop your head back as far as it goes. Relax your head, relax your neck, let it fall off. Eyes open, close your mouth. All you do, Carol, stay here. You don't have to go any further. When you're ready, bring your arms back. Immediately try to touch the windows behind you. Bend your spine backwards, coccyx to the left. Lower back, move up, upper back, total spine backward. Bend and keep going. Stay with it, then you try to fold them backwards. And help with stomach legs, sit everything forward, arms back. Look back, fall back, way back, go back, more back. Inhale, come up. Stomach in, you go down, sucking your stomach. Bend the knees if you need to. Oh, yeah. Reach for the floor. Bend your knees. Move your hips right, left, right, left. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Nice, loose, comfortable, easy, flexible. If you can't touch the floor yet, bend the knees. Touch the floor. Let your head hang heavy. Shake your head yes. Shake your head no. Do full squats if you want to. Let's set it up. Toes and heels together. Scoop up your heels from behind. Underneath your heels. Stepping on all five fingers of each hand. Little baby fingers. Stretching each other side by side. Please don't lose the grip. Pull on your heels. Stretch your body down from the lower spine towards the floor. Touch your stomach on your thigh, your chest on your knee. Relax your head down and touch your face on the legs below the knees. From the side, your body should look like a Japanese hand sandwich. There's no room for lighter or air wraps anywhere. Continuously keep pulling. Pulling is the object of stretching. Pull on your heels. Push your knees back. Feel the tremendous stretching. Feeling pain sensation all over underneath your legs. Inside out, bolts to the skin, coccyx to the toes with your smiling, happy face. Go ahead, smile. You love this. Last chance, lock your knees. Lock your knees. Lock your knees. Inhale. 
toes and heels together. Inhale, arms up. Over the head. Interlock your ten fingers. Release the index fingers. Thumbs cross. We get to do yoga together today. We're so lucky. Stretch out. Take a deep breath and go. Right away to the right. None of this. I have to do yoga. You get to. Bring your body down. You have to reframe. Make it positive. Hips forward, upper body back. Leg muscles nice and tight. You have plenty of time now to do this all the time. Push your left hip forward, come down. Push. Right shoulder forward, come down. Push. Smile and happy face. Trick your brain into thinking you're having a good time. Happy Friday. Push, come down. Push, come down. Push, come down. Push. And now breathe in. Come up. Nice one. Stretch up and over. Right away. Up and over. No dilly dally. Push your hips to the right. We are your flexibility. Feel the tremendous stretching feeling down the right side. Warming up your spine. Every single direction. Hips forward, upper body back. Bring your right hip forward. Come down. Use the left arm. Pull the right arm down. Stretch your arms. Inhale. Come down. Push. Come down. Push. Come down. Push. Come down. Push. Inhale. Breathe in. Come up. Beautiful. That was the best one. Take a deep breath. Pull the arms up. Your head back. Just let it hang. Shake it. Yes. Shake it. No. If that feels good for you. Let it fall off. Hands palm together. Bring your arms back. Immediately try to touch the windows behind you. Bend your spine backwards, coccyx to the neck. Lower back to the back, upper back. You feel that. Try to fall down backwards. Maximum body weight to your heels. Inhale, push. Stomach, legs, six, everything forward. Go hard on your arms back. Look back. Fall back. Way back. Go back. More back. Inhale, come up. Stomach, can you go down? That was a good one. Whatever you're thinking about, worrying about, poof. It's gone. Hands on the floor. Shake it, shake it, shake it. Right, left. If you can, keep your feet on the floor, hands on the floor. Bend your knees and move your butt. That's going to get more into the lower back. Feel the difference. If you're lifting up your heels, that's a totally different stretch. Save that for later. Let's set it up. Grab your heels from behind. Underneath your heels, set them off the fingers if you can. Little baby fingers touching each other side by side. Don't lose the grip. Elbows behind your legs. Some big elbows touch each other. Go for it. Forward your heels, stretch your body down. Put your tongue around your thighs. Check. Put your chest on your knees, check. Put your face on the legs, triple check. From the side, body should look like a Japanese hand sandwich. There's no room for life or no gap, no space. No room anywhere. Let's see the two on your heels, push your knees back off your knees. Exhale, breathe off your knees. Roll forward, double doors, more to the toes. More to the toes. Hips come off, heels come off the floor. Hips go up toward the ceiling, stretch your head down. The bowl is to touch the top of the head, top of the feet. Everybody, squeeze the elbows together. Lock your knees. Lock your knees. Lock your knees. Lock your knees. Inhale, breathe you got it. We're in the business now. Stretch up out of the way. Touch the ceiling. Change. Arms float down by your side. Welcome to your new spine. Welcome to your Friday yoga class. Upper pose. Look at us. Let's step right to the right. Six inches apart. Heels invisible. All three parts. Please don't move your feet. Bring your arms up. Parallel to the floor. Suck your stomach in. Hold it and sit down like you're sitting in the chair. Do be flat position. 100% body weight in your heels, spine straight to begin with. Lift your chest up. Bend your total spine back or bend it. Bring your upper body back. Step your stomach in. Compression of the abdominal wall. Open your knees. Six inches, toes, heels, knees, and hands. Chest up, chin up, lean back. Stretch your arms forward. Lean back. Fall back. Way back. Go back. More back. Hold it. Try to fall down backwards. Inhale, breathe. Come up. You got it. Come on the toes. Maximum like a bow. Bring it all the way up. Stretch your spine, chest, head. Imagine I am pulling your hair up toward the ceiling. You like it. Stomach in. Sit down. On top of the toes. Welcome alone. Yeah. Join us. Sit down into the chair. Knees up, chest up. Hi, mommy. Get right into the posture. Knees up, chest up. Sit down into the chair. Hips should not go down below the chair. You're sitting in the chair. Inhale. Come up. Third part. Come on the toes a little bit. Bring your knees together. You can stay right here. You don't have to go any further than this. Stomach in. You go down. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Slow, broken elevator ride. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, one. Continuously stretch your spine up. Half inch down between your hips and heels. Knees together and four towards the front there. Thighs parallel to the floor. Arms parallel to the legs. From the side, your body should look like a box. Stomach in. Slowly come up. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lower the heels. Right foot back. Arms down by your side. Warming up the leg muscles. If you've been running, riding the bike, walking a lot, good for the leg. Second set. Second right to the right. Even if you're not doing that, toning and trimming the legs. Bring your arms up. Parallel to the floor. Squeeze the pinky finger, the ring finger, no navel dangle, stomach in, sit down. You've been here before, you know what to do. Sit down into the chair. Body weight to your heels. Go ahead, lift up your toes, make sure, lean back. Stretch your arms forward, lean back. Tilt the upper body back, lean back. Fall back, way back, go back, freeze. Hold it, stretch your arms forward, try to fall down backwards. Inhale, come up. Perfect! Come on the toes. Good listening today, all the way up on the tippy toes. Get off the balls of your feet, strong arms, sit down. On top of the toes. 
Let's keep this down again. Sit down into the chair. Knees up, chest up. Knees up, chest up. Upper body leaning back. Higher on the toes. Knees up toward the ceiling. Fight for it. The shaking is good. Hips should not go down below the chair. You're sitting in the chair. Inhale, come up. Third part. Come on the toes. Bring your knees together. Stomach and you go down. Your own count this time. Take your time to inhale. Slow, broken, elevator, ride all the way down, all the way down. Continue to stretch your spine. Now try not to rest. Go ahead and bounce a couple times like a motorcycle ride. Bounce and bounce. Bounce and bounce. Freeze. Hold it. Slowly come up. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Lower the heels. Right foot back. Arms down by your side. One more posture. You got a water break. Stay with me. Eagle pose, got rest in the right arm. Left arm. Don't mix them up. Bring your arms up. Over your head sideways. Swing the right arm underneath the left arm. Good. Swing the chin. Cross the elbows, wrists, hands, palms together. If you can't do the wrists, the hands yet, you can always put your hands on the shoulders. Sit down. Like you're sitting in the chair, stomach in. Lift your right leg up. Bring it over the left leg. Cross your legs, switch your leg. You can always swing the knees over to the left. Get the foot hooked, and then slowly bring the knees to the right. Good, tiny adjustments. Knees to the right, up right to the left, feet, knees, elbows, hands, everything in one line. Foot is coming out, sit down, move. Losing the balance, upper body back more. Some again. Pull the elbows down, bring your upper body back at the end. Jay, come up, arms over your head. Left side, do the left arm swing. Underneath the right arm, pull, pull. <clears throat> Try to get the fingertips below the nose, sit down. Stomach in, hold it. Lift up your left leg, bring it over the right. The higher you lift your leg, the more room you create to twist your legs like ropes. Remember, there's no magic pill. You gotta do this, you gotta try it. You're healing the body. Knees to the left, upper right to the right. Feet, knees, elbows, hands, everything in one line. Foot is coming out, sit down more. Losing the balance, upper body back more. Squeeze the legs, squeeze the arms. Bring your upper body back at the end. Change, come up, arms over the head. Second set, we do right arm, right leg. Same time, strike, go, swing. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, that was good. Foot under the calf muscle, breathe. Knees to the right, up to the right, to the left. Everything one line in the front here. Foot is coming out, sit down more. Losing the balance, upper body back more. Stomach in, hold it. Bring your upper body back at the end, hold it. Change, come up, arms over the head. Left arm, left leg, go. Swing. You're opening up, massaging the 14 major joints in your body, seven on each side. Foot under the calf muscle. Sweat dripping down from your elbows to your knees. Yeah, I feel that. Knees to the left, upper body to the right. Everything in line in the front here. Sit down more. Pull the elbows down. Bring your upper body back with the end. Hold it. Don't throw it away. Hold it. Change. Come up. There you go. Arms to the head. Arms down side. Party time. Go ahead. Grab a quick sip of water if you like. Hi, Ashish. Hi, Frank. Welcome, welcome. Cheers. Remember, you can reach for the foot, you can keep the left foot, just the toe on the floor, 
working on the strong foundation. Mom, look at your quad. Engage the quad, squeeze the glute, suck in your stomach. You have no knee. Inhale when you're ready, leg up. Bring it exactly parallel to the floor, no higher, no lower. Flex your foot. Learn how to stretch your Achilles tendon directly above the heel. Both knees locked, cramps on the thighs, bend your elbows. Good shot. Elbows go down below the calf muscle. Big toe down. Hold it, Alex. Watch the ankle. Lock your knee. Lock your knee. Change. Elbow straight. Leg in. And lay down. Nice one. Hands on your hips. Do a quick one second back bend. You did the forward bend. You did the back bend. Counteract. Should feel very good. All right. Let's do it again. You're warmed up. Second one will be better. Shift the weight to the left leg. Wipe your hands. Interlock the ten fingers. Pick up your foot. Three. Two, one. Make up your mind right now. The moment you think about something else, you fall out. Stay here, stay present. Inhale, bring the leg up. Bring it exactly parallel to the floor. Heel forward. Bend your elbows. Elbows go below the calf muscles. Some again. Wherever you are, take your time. Tuck your chin to your chest. Body down, head down. Put the forehead on the knee. Hold it. Lock your knee. Lock your knee. Change. Head up first. Elbows straight. Leg in. And lay down. Sometimes you fall out. You do what you can with the body you have today. Shift the weight to the right leg, wipe your hands. Interlock your ten fingers, pick up your foot. Three, two, one. Remember, right leg. The longer you think about it, the harder it gets. Pick up your foot. Inhale, bring the leg up. Bring it exactly parallel to the floor. No higher, no lower. Take your time. Take it easy, honey. Bend your elbows. Elbows will be low. The calf muscle very slow. Tuck your chin to your chest. Put your forehead on the knee. Big toe down, stomach in. Lock your knee. Lock your knee. Change. Head up first. Elbow straight. Crown. Leg in. And leg down. Nice one. Hands on your hips. Another quick one second back then. All right. We're done with that one for today. Yay. Tango both one goes down the knee. I'm going to do your right hand up. Elbow close to the body. Everybody say, Mom, give me the money. I hear you. Don't turn your hand. Don't drop the money. Bring your hand out to the right. Drop it straight down. Keep the wrist straight and grab the ankle inside. Five fingers together, nice tight grip. Left arm up. Chin close to the shoulder. Bring your knees together to start. Take a deep breath, stretch up, and go. Charge your body forward. Simultaneously kick the right leg back and up. Bring the body down from the lower spine. Chest and abdomen parallel to the floor. Left shoulder forward, right shoulder back. Maybe you stretch it equal simultaneous 50 50. If you lose the balance, you're not kicking hard enough. Kick more, kick harder. Lock the standing leg kick. Try for the standing split. Stretch forward, more kick. Body down kick. Use your extra strength here at the end. Take a deep breath. Kick up one more time and hold. Change. Come up. Toes and heels together. Arms down by your side. Blood filtering one side of your body to the other. Normal if you feel out of breath. You're alive. That's great. Left side. Left hand up. Take out the money. Bring your hand up to the left. Drop it down. Keep the wrist straight and grab your ankle. Inside. Five fingers together. Nice tight grip. Right arm up. Chin goes to the shoulder. Bring your knees together to start. Stretch up. And go. Charge your body forward like you mean it. Standing leg locked. Look forward. Stretch forward. Shoulder to the chin, shoulder blade scalp is coming out of the body. Kicking, stretching, equal simultaneous 50 50. If you lose the balance, you're not kicking hard enough. Kick, body down, kick. Stretch forward, more knee, more kick harder. Harder you kick your balance here forever. Stretch forward, take a deep breath. Kick up one more time, hold it. Don't throw it away, hold it. Change, come up. Beautiful job. Toes and heels together. You're doing great. You're enjoying. Take a deep breath. <sighs> Let's do it again. This side, bring your right arm down, left arm up, same time. Go. Good. Hi, Aya. I wondered where you were. Stretch up and go. It's very quick, the second set. Bring your body down, go right to where you left off in the first set. Come down deeper, come down further. Strong foundation. Standing one leg, a balancing series. Stretch forward, kick, body down, kick. Use the extra strength, go someplace new today. Stretch forward, chin forward, take a deep breath, kick up, mold. Change. Come up. Toes and heels together. Arms down by your side. Very nice. Left arm down, right arm up. Go. Have some confidence. High five yourself. Stretch up and go. You know you can't high five anyone else, so you high five yourself. Bring your body down. Call that the Corona high five. Right shoulder for kick. Left shoulder back kicking, stretching equal simultaneous 50-50. Find the balance, the kicking and the stretching. The flexibility and the strength. Chest down. Chest and abdomen parallel to the floor. Take a deep breath. Use your legs. Stand in splits. Kick up one more time. Hold. Change. Come on. Toes and heels together. That was me, buddy. <sighs> Time for the balancing stick. Two little investments. Ten seconds long. Arms up the head. Interlock your ten fingers. Release the index fingers. Thumbs cross. Chin up. Lean your upper body back. 
right leg step forward. Big step and go. Lock both knees. 10 seconds. Chest down, leg up. Body down, leg up. Welcome, welcome, Harold. Bring the body down. Stretch. Stretch the arms forward. Get in this one, Dad. Good for the heart. Stretch your arms forward. Stretch and stretch. Leg up. Stretch. Stretch. Change. Come up. Arms up. Chin up. Knee to your upper body back. Doing great. Left side, left arm, left leg. Step four. Big step. Go. 10 seconds. Got to get the chest down. Flushing out the horseshoe artery of the heart. Watch the right leg. The right knee cap facing the floor. Sole of the foot facing the ceiling. Stomach in. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Change. Come up. Arms up. Arms down by your side. Take a moment. Having a little mini heart attack in here. That's good. So you don't have everyone outside of this room. Second set. Inhale. Arms up. Over the head. Interlock your chest. Fingers release the index. Fingers down. Cross. Chin up. Lean the upper body back. Ready? Give me the good one. Right leg. Step four. Big step. And go. Ten. Nine, welcome, Patty. Eight, seven, get the leg up, stretch your arms forward, shoulder blades, cap is coming out of the body. Stomach in, stretch, everybody stretch, everybody stretch, everybody stretch, change. Come up, arms up. Arms, stay up there. One more, left leg, I was going to cheat you. Left leg, step forward. Big step, no cheating. Go, bring the body down. Look forward, stretch forward. You're looking forward, underneath the arms. If you had a mirror, you see the left big toe visible in the front mirror. Leg up, point your toes, stretch, and stretch, stomach in, stretch, stretch, stretch. And come up, keep your arms up there. Step to the left of your space, step over the space. If you have a mat, over the mat. If not, four feet distance, arms parallel to the floor. Chin up, you go down. Look forward, and chin forward. There you go, all the way down. When you can't see yourself anymore, grab your heels from the outside. If you can grab your heels, you can grab the feet. You can put your hands on the floor here in front of you. You can reach for the floor. However it is you need to do it, you feel the stretch in the back of the legs. Legs stretch. Your hamstrings stretch. Your legs are straight. If you have your heels, bend your elbows back towards the shins. Legs stretch, hips stretch. Lower spine, full spine, full body stretching. 360 degree angle, coccyx to the toes, coccyx to the forehead, you pull. Roll forward like a wheel. If you're just letting gravity help you, that's fine. But you can make more happen. Legs stretch, roll forward to the toes. Roll forward, stretch your head down, stretch your neck. Shoulders up toward the ceiling. Roll forward again and graze your hairline on the floor in between your feet. Touch it. Change. Come up. Oh, that felt good. Hips forward, lean the upper body back. Try and close. Trigonasana, turn the right foot out. Two heels are in one line. Bend the knees, sit down. Bounce. And back. So right back, bicep, femur bone parallel to the floor. Don't let it come up anymore. Spine straight, arms back. Inhale, move. Both arms. Bring your elbow in front of the knee. Reach down, touch your toes. Look out, touch your chin to the shoulder. Left arm up, right arm down. Two arms, shoulder stretching in opposite directions. Push your left foot forward. Turn, push your upper body back. Stretch up, touch the ceiling. Keep the left knee locked. Left foot flat on the floor. Inhale, come up. Good. Right foot in, hips forward. <clears throat> upper body back. Turn the left foot out. Bend the knee, sit down. Bounce. And bounce. You're using the bounce. Make sure you're sitting down low enough. Spine straight in the center. Arms back. Inhale. Move both arms. Maybe you just do the legs today, Autumn. That's okay. Reach down. Touch your toes. Look up. Touch your chin to the shoulder. Right arm up. Left arm down. Two arm shoulder stretching in opposite directions. Breathe. Push the right hip forward. Turn. Twist your upper body back. Right knee locked. Right foot flat on the floor. Inhale. Come up. Good. Standing step by head. Knee close down. You want to be more proud of Jump your chest and arms over the head. Hands, palms together. Cross your thumbs. It's like they're in prayer. Turn to the right. Turn your hips one, two, three, four, five times. If you're just joining me, try this. Hi there, you made it. Chin to your chest. You go down. Throat choked. Eyes open. Round your spine. Take your time. Take it easy, honey. When you get down here, you can touch the floor. Bring your hands apart if you need to for balance. Say hello to your knee. If the forehead and knee are not touching, you can bend the knee up. As much as you need to, you must touch the forehead on the knee. Throat chucked, eyes open, breathing normal. Maximum body weight in the right leg, right hip up, left hip down, stomach in. Use the hands, push the floor away, more of a compression, quick. Try to lock both knees a couple of times. Inhale, come up, stay facing the right. Take it easy, left hip forward, arms with the ears, inhale, all the way up. Turn to the center. Turn to the left, 185 degrees, right hip forward, back foot 45 degrees. Chin to your chest. Exhale, you go down, throat choked. Eyes open, make sure you're breathing. You know what happens when you stop breathing, right? <laughs> you know, I don't need to tell you, put the forehead on the knee. Maximum body weight in the left leg like this time. Do me a favor, look at your belly button, be your own teacher. If your belly button is pointing too far to the right, 
Then you gotta bring the left hip up more, two hips in one line. Extending the kidneys equally, front chuck thighs open. Push the floor away, it's nice iron. Good Jody, get higher in the knee, try to lock both knees a couple of times. Inhale, come up, nice and homing. Take your time, take it easy, up on the exit, all the way up. Turn to the center. Right foot back to the place, arms down by your side. Take a deep breath. In through your nose, ah, through your nose. You're feeling good. You're doing good. Let's do it again. Inhale, arms up. Over the head, right foot, stretch to the right bone. If you did not touch the forehead with your on the floor, then take a little wider step. Hips forward. You go down. Look forward. Chin forward. Go down. Take it easy. Take it slow. You feel that stretch in the hamstrings. Oh, yeah. Feels good. Grab your heels. We're going to have nice and juicy hamstrings for the next two days. You're welcome. Grab the heels, leg stretch, hip stretch, lower spine, full spine, full body stretching. 360 degree angle coxswain to the toes, coxswain to the forehead. Stay here for a second. If we stay here long enough, everybody would touch. Gravity would make it happen, but we don't have time. So bend your elbows and pull. Stretch your head down, pull. Stretch your neck, roll to the toes, lock the knees again. Feel more of a stretch. Stretch your head down and braid your hairline on the floor in between your feet. Roll forward, touch it. Jane. Very nice. Looks good. Give forward the upper body back. Press it out. Bend the knee. Move the arms. Go. Swing. Elbow in front of the knee. Look up. Touch your chin to the shoulder. Stretch up. Come on, William. Stretch up. Left arm up, right arm down. Two arms over stretching in opposite direction. Sit down. Stretch up. Turn to your upper body back. Left knee long. Left foot flat on the floor. Inhale. Come up. Right foot in. Hips forward. <clears throat> upper body back. Left foot out. Bend the knee. Move the arms. Go. Look up. Take your mind off this. Next week we're doing the same schedule, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, hips forward, turn to your upper body back. We're all in the triangle together, right knee lock, right foot flat on the floor. Inhale, come up, good. Arms up the head, hands, palms together, cross your thumbs, turn to the right, your hands are in prayer, you're praying for it to get done. Chin to your chest, exhale, you go down, throat choked. Eyes open, look at the belly button, stomach, 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 round the spine. Try to touch the forehead. Oh, she wants time off. I love you too, buddy. Put the forehead on the knee. Your dogs get into this with you. You start sweating. And then come over and <laughs> lick it off. Grab your spine and hit the belly button. Again, this time, if the belly button is pointing to the left, that means you've got to get the right hip up. The belly button should be pointing straight down to the floor. That means your two hips are in one line. Push the floor away. More of a compression. Try to lock both knees. Inhale, come up. It's a compression pose. Not a stretching pose, compressing the internal organs. Turn to the center, <clears throat> turn to the left, 185 degrees right, and forward elbows locked into your chest. You go down, throat choked. Very uncomfortable. Good for your thyroid, your immune system. More medical benefits in this posture than any other posture. She has. That's enough. I love you too, buddy. Forehead on the knee. Bend the knee up as much as you need to. You do whatever you need to do. You know your body more than I do. So you put the forehead on the knee and leave it there the whole time. Throat choke, eyes open, stomach in. Push the floor away. Try to bring the hands palms close together. Try to lock both knees a couple of times. Inhale, come up. Stay facing the left. Inhale. Oh, yeah. Turn to the center. Right foot back to the place. Arms down back. Good. Take one step back, middle of your mat, middle of your towel. Two more standing postures, and then we'll be on the floor. Go with this another go at it. Good, William. You got to keep trying it. Nothing worth having is easy. Tree pose. Lift your right leg up. Tadasana. One, two, three, four, five times. It's like you're doing a bicep curl. Grab the foot. Slowly, gently let the knee come down. Foot touching with your costume heel, touching the ceiling. Push your hips forward, lean the upper body back. Do the right hand first. If you can balance, do the left hand. If your foot slips, your knee bends, your butt sticks out, keep holding onto your foot. Thigh contracted, eyes open, you're breathing normal. Nice and proud, tree stretch up toward the ceiling. Toe stand, focus on the floor, four feet in front of you. Don't move your eyes, don't move your eyes. Slowly bend forward. Start to bend forward, even if it's just a little bit. Bend forward at the waist, reach for the floor. Once you touch the floor, you can stay there or bend the knees and down. Bring your hips to your heel. Walk your hands both sides of your body. Joyce, are you still here? I remember your choice stand when I taught you in Singapore. It was perfect. Bring your left hand up first. If 
you can balance, bring the right hand up. Stretch your spine up, hips up, suck your stomach in, eyes up, levitate, beautiful, reach in half and top your heel. Tree, you stay there, you wait for toe, toe you come out. Exactly the opposite the way you went down, come back to the standing, knee together at the tree, hold it. Release, right leg down. Lift up your left leg, last standing posture, finish the standing series, standing very careful with the knee, slowly gently let it come down. Push your hips forward, lean the upper body back through the left hand. This is safe to do this yoga every single day. Bring your right hand up if your foot slips, keep holding on to the foot. Hips forward, lean the upper body back. Eyes open, you're breathing normal. Good. Focus on the floor. Slowly bend forward, bend at the waist. Reach for the floor. And William, your postures might not look like mine. My postures don't look like somebody else's. When you're ready, go ahead and bend the knee. Sit down, bring your hips to your heel. That's the beauty of this yoga. You do whatever you can with the body you have today. Do the left hand first. When you're ready, do the right hand. Keep stretching up, half and tuck your heel. Over time, you will see your body change. You'll observe it. All these kind of wonderful things will happen in your body and also in your life. Half and tuck your heel, eyes up, levitate. You change your life. Tree, wait for toe, toe come out. Exactly the opposite the way you went down. Come back to the standing. Meet together at the tree. Hold it just for a second. And then release the left leg down. Acknowledge your standing series however you choose. Turn around, lie down on your back. So that's enough. This is your dead body pose. We're right on time. Grab a quick sip if you like. This is a good time. Let me adjust the cameras. Get down here on the floor. Relax. Heels together, toes fall open. Arms on the towel, hands, palms face the ceiling. Oh good, Chance got there before I said I can do the, <laughs> the camera. Thank you, Chance, for being my doggy model. It's perfect. All right, lie down on your back. Heels touch, toes fall open. Arms on the towel, let me get in. Hands, palms, face to the ceiling. Pick a spot on the ceiling, preferably above your toes. Good morning, Mary. That will help you get your neck in a neutral position. Completely relaxed. Slide down. Take some deep breaths. Acknowledge all of your hard work in the standing series. You're doing amazing things for yourself in this class. Maybe this is the only 60 minutes you have of the day by yourself. So take advantage of it. Be selfish with this 60 minutes. 60 minute open mind moving meditation. Change. When you're moving pose, Pavana Mukhtasana. Lift your right leg up. Hold your right leg. Interlock the ten fingers all the way to the webbing tight grip. Grab the knee, two inches below the knee. Pull the right knee down towards the right shoulder. Completely avoid the rib cage. Left leg straight. Bring your elbows in. Arms elbows close to the body. Shin down toward your chest. Back in the neck. Flat on the floor. Freeze there. Don't move. You can't even blink your eyes. You have to pull a little bit extra hard. Keep pulling. Without intermission, without interruption. Chin to your chest. Left shoulder down. Pull more. Pull harder. Suck in your stomach. Feel the pinching sensation. Pull down one more time. Change. Legs down. Arms down. Good for the ascending colon on this side. Left side. Lift your left leg up. This is the descending. Interlock the ten fingers. Grab the knee. Two inches below the knee. Bring it to the left. Down towards the left shoulder. Completely avoiding the root cage. Chin down. Show me your double, triple, quadruple chin. That will be the better. Right shoulder down. Pull more. If the hands are slipping, push the pads of your fingers into the backs of your hands. Relax the left foot. Use your arm strength. Pull more. Pull harder. Extra strength. Take a deep breath. Pull that one more time. Change. Legs down. Arms down. Immediately both legs lift up. Grab your elbows each other over the legs. A couple of inches below the knees if possible. Nice and tight there. If you can't grab your elbows, that's okay. Grab wherever you can. Uncross your feet. Chin down toward the chest. Back of the neck. Flat on the floor. Shoulders down. Hips down. Freeze there. If this is very uncomfortable, then that means you need it, honey. Stay with it. Change. 
skin down toward your chest. Eventually, in the future, you improve your skeletal system. The bone joints enough. Then only your whole spine, coccyx, and the neck will be flat on the floor. Okay, so legs down. Arms down, heels touch. Toes fall open. Take a moment. You just flush the toilet in your body. Clean out your ascending colon on the right, descending colon on the left. Transverse colon, that's the one that runs horizontal. That's where stuff gets stuck and causes diseases. So that's why if that one's very uncomfortable. That's the one that you need to do. You need to stay with that one. Time for the sit up. Touch your feet, toes, and heels together. Arms over the head. Hands, palms facing the ceiling. Cross your thumbs. Try to keep your arms with your ears. See if you can do it. Chin to your chest. Inhale. Sit up. Exhale. Quick. Grab your big toes, forehead to the knees, elbows to the floor. Lift up your heels, toes towards your face. Blow it out. Turn around. Lie down on your stomach. Don't worry. We work on those every single day. You do whatever you can in the sit-up. Chin out. Hands under the shoulders. Not too far up, too far down. Right underneath. Thumbs under the nipples. You have one leg like a cobra's tail. Ten toes on the floor. Look forward. Look up toward the ceiling. And lift upper body up. Peel your body off the floor. Only your belly button touching before the rest of the body is in the air. From the side. Elbows look like an L. Stretch your elbows down. Shoulders down. Trapezius muscles visible. Look up. Smile. Chest up. Come up. Couple more inches. Make sure the lower back hurts. Hold it there. Freeze. Change. Slowly come down. Good. Our straight position. Flip the arms. Hands, palms face the floor. So you're grabbing the floor and not towards the ceiling. Good. Walk your hips. Move your hips so you can get the elbows, arms underneath your body. It's like you're going to bump a volleyball under the body. Chin forward. Look forward. Left leg relax. Right leg lift up. Lock it. Lift your point. Leg up, leg up, leg up. We're coming over the top of the head. Push your hands down, shoulders down. Lock the knee, point the toe, hands down, take a deep breath, come on, move. Okay, slowly come down, relax the right leg, left leg lift up. Don't let the right leg help you, it's like a dead leg. Leg up, push your hands down, shoulders, working the top third of the spine. Lock the knee, point the toe, come on, move. Okay, slowly come down. Put your mouth down one, kiss your child, shoulders down, take a deep breath without bending your knees, lift both legs up, come up. Everybody go up, go up, everybody come up. It doesn't matter how high you come up. Roll forward like a wheel, shoulders down, hands down, take a deep breath, come up, move. Okay, slowly come down. Arms up to the side of your plank wing. Stretch your arms apart, sit up your legs. One leg like a cobra's tail, don't let it open up. Arms, body, head, legs, everything lift up. 747 taking off, go up. Arms up, arms back. Fingers should stay the same on the top of the head. All your hip bones touching the floor, chest up, chest up, chest up, look up. Exhale, breathing, come up, move. Change, slowly come down. Grab your feet from the outside. Six inches between the knees, six inches between the feet. Grab right at the toe cleavage. You can do one leg at a time if you need to. Chin forward, look up, and gently kick your legs up. Look up, kick up. Look up, kick up. Kick, kick, kick. Use your legs. Roll forward like a wheel. Soft part of your belly on the floor. Knees in, toes out. Wrist straight, pointed toes, head up. Use the legs. Wrist straight, pointed toes. Take a deep breath, kick up, move. Change, slowly come down. Look to the right, left ear down. Get your whole ear on the towel, back of the ear. Give yourself a little neck stretch. Chin to the shoulder, shoulder to the chin. Big toes touch, heels fall open. Relax. Take some deep breaths. You're healing your spine here from the inside out, strengthening your spine. You won't have the back problems if you have a strong spine. Let's do it again. Chin up, hands underneath your shoulders as they were. Not too far up, too far down, too far in. Glue it down, hands, palms on the floor. You have one leg. Make sure the 10 toes are on the floor. Ladies, pay attention. I know a lot of us, we roll the feet in, myself included. I really have to think about the 10 toes down. Look up toward the ceiling and lift. Upper body up. Peel your body off the floor. There you go. You see how it is? It totally changes when you put the 10 toes on the floor. Stretch your elbows down, shoulders down. Breathe. Come up, make sure the lower back hurts. Hold it there, freeze, just for a second, feel it. Change, slowly come down. You feel that compression. Arms your position, flip the palms, hands, palms face the floor. Move your hips side to side. Try to keep the elbows close together. Someday the elbows are gonna touch each other under the body. Chin forward, look forward. Cutting off the blood supply, left leg relax, right leg up. You're bringing back the normal range of motion to the arms. Push your hands down, shoulders down. Go for the carpal tunnel, leg up, leg up. Leg up, okay, slowly come down. Relax the right leg, left leg up. Good for the golf game. Push your hands down, shoulders down. Remember to turn right is tendonitis. Push your hands down, shoulders down. Leg up, leg up, leg up, leg up. Okay, slowly come down. Put your mouth down. Kiss your towel. Keep the mouth on the towel. Protect your cervical spine. Take a deep breath and lift both legs up. Come up. Everybody go up. Go up. Everybody come up. You can do it. Struggle a little bit harder. Roll forward. Push your hands down. Try to lift up your legs. Take a deep breath. Come on, go. Okay, slowly. 
struggle to come down. Fold out this foot, the corner is all about, sit up. Stretch your arms and brace up your legs. Everything nice, tight, contracted. Easier to get off the floor. Tight muscle is a light muscle. Ready? Arms, body, head, legs, everything with them. 747, taking off, go. Arms up, arms back. Fingertips should be the same as the top of the head. Only your heels touching the floor, chest up, breathe. Look up, breathe. Smile, exhale, breathing. Come up one more time. Change, slowly come down. You got that one, middle back. Grab your feet, right from the outside. Six, right at the toe cleavage. You can start with the knees and feet closer together this time. Take a deep breath and go. Gently keep your legs up. Look up, kick up. Look up, kick up, kick, kick, kick. Roll forward like a wheel, roll forward. Bring your rib cage down towards the floor. Knees and toes out. Wrist straight, pointed toes. Head up more, breathe. Open the shoulders, use your legs. Take a deep breath, kick up one more time. Change, slowly come down. Look to the left, right here, down. Take some deep breaths in through your nose. Out through your nose. Breathe. Maximum exertion in the posture. Maximum relaxation in your savasana. Okay, that's enough. Chin out, hands underneath your shoulder. Do a good push up. Come to the top of the mat. Fix firm pose. Supta Vajrasana. We're right here at the end. Don't leave me yet. Stay with me. Open the feet. Sit your hips down in between your heels. If your knees are killing you, then you know what to do. You can start up on the knees. Start up like this. Slowly start bringing the, bring the butt down so you get the knees down. You walk your hands back. You slowly keep bringing the knees down. Eventually, butts on the floor, heels touching with your hips. If you're not here yet, then you stay here. The whole entire posture. This is your posture today. If your butt's on the floor, you go. Hands on the feet, right elbow, left elbow, one by one. Top of the head, back of the head, shoulders on the floor. Eventually, your whole upper body is relaxed on the floor. Bring your arms up. Over your head, grab your elbows, each other. Pull your elbows down. Shin down, eyes open, breathe normal. Keep lifting up the chest. If this is killing your knees, your ankles, you need it. Bringing back the normal range of motion. Chin down towards your chest. Eyes open, breathing normal. Put your hands on your feet with the help of the elbows. Come up. Turn around. Straighten your legs. Three. Two. One. Total relaxation. As soon as you get in your savasana, legs go straight. You're cutting off the blood supply. When you get in the posture, zoom. The high speed nutrient rich blood rushes to your knees, your ankles, your toes, healing the injuries from the inside out, bringing back the normal range of motion. You can heal yourself. Just takes time, frequency, precision, patience with your practice. Time for the sit up. Let your feet, toes, and heels together. Arms to the head, chin to your chest. Inhale, sit up. Go. Quick. Blow it out. Pour it to the knees, elbows to the floor, heels off the floor. Turn around. Keep trying to get those heels off the floor. Turn around. Come back to the top of the mat. Sit down Japanese style. Open the knees, the feet as wide as you need to. New York to LA. Whatever it is that you need to do in this posture. Open the knees, the feet. Put your hips on the floor. When you're ready, do the left elbow, right elbow, one by one. Top of the head, back of the head, shoulders on the floor. Eventually, your whole upper body is relaxed on the floor. Bring your arms up over the head. Grab your elbows each other over the head. Pull your elbows down. Chin down, eyes open, breathing normal. If this feels like nothing, you're a gummy, then good for you. You really have to focus on the back bend then. Lift your chest up. More of a back bend. Chin down for your chest. Breathe. Push your feet more into the floor. Bring the knees closer. You feel that stretch in the front of the quad. Eyes open, breathing normal. Put your hands on your feet. Put the help of the elbows. Come up. This time, put your hands in front. Walk the legs back one by one, right and left. Right and left, middle of your mat, middle of your tail, half toward his pose, Ardhakramasana, arms of the head, hands, palms together. Chin out, look forward, and you go down. Look forward, stretch forward. Don't let gravity take over. Your muscles doing the work. Try to touch the forehead a little bit. You can just touch. Rest of your arms in the air, shoulders like sapless coming out of the body. Your shoulders are supposed to hurt. Shut your arms forward, shut your hips back. Body stretching in opposite directions. If any part of your hands on the floor other than the pinkies tilt up the wrist, make the hands, palms closer together. Stretch your hips back toward your heels, stomach in. Head below your heart, blood going to your brain. More relaxation than eight hours of sleep. Waking up the dead brain cells. Stretch the arms forward, stretch. And stretch. Inhale, come up. Oh, very good. Muscles working, arms down by your side. Stand up on your knees, camel pose, just stressing up. I'm going to turn to the side. You stay right there. Stand on the knees. Six inches between the knees, six inches between the feet. Tops of the feet on the floor. So none of this. Tops of the feet on the floor. Hands on your hips. Like putting your hands in your imaginary jean pockets. Take a deep breath. Hips forward, head back. You can stay right 
right here. You don't have to go any further than this. This is starting the backward bend. When you're ready, go out halfway and stop in the middle. You can stay right here too. You don't have to go any further. You can keep your hands on your hips, supporting your spine. When you are ready, with the right hand first, grab your right heel. Thumbs on the outside, fingers on the inside. Left hand, grab your left heel. Thumbs on the outside, fingers on the inside. Full palm grip on your heels. Some of you can walk down towards the end step. You know who you are. Eyes open, close your mouth. Take a deep breath, push. Stomach, legs, sits, everything forward. Keep pushing hips forward. Lift your chest up, chest and heart up towards the ceiling. Breathe. I want 360 degree angle backward bending with gravitation. Put your hands on your hips and come up slowly. Support the spine. Come all the way up. Good. Sit down, grab a pose, Sasangasana. Welcome, Kristen. Welcome, welcome. Flip the top corners over your heels. I wondered where you were. Yeah, nice and tight grip. If you've never done this one before, watch me. Your hands go here on the hips. You just drop them down. Thumbs on the outside, fingers on the inside. Pull on your heels. Chin to your chest, and you go down. Throw chuck. Eyes open. Use the arms. You're pulling as you go down. Vertebra by vertebra, forward and the knees, top of the head on the floor, tight grip, hips up. Roll forward like a wheel, roll forward, top of the head, crown of the head on the floor. Walk your knees up one by one, right and left, right and left, close out the gap between the knees and the forehead, feel it in your spine. Coccyx to the neck, the neck might hurt a little bit, shoulders out of the ears, pull, tops of the feet on the floor, bring your heels closer together. Suck in your stomach, use your arm strength, stay with me, Helen, shoulders up toward the ceiling, take a deep breath, hips up, mold. Grab the heels and pull. Use the arms. Arms doing all the work here on the exit. Take your time. Use your muscles. Head comes up last. Good. Flip out the towel. Turn around. Leg out. Relax. Three. Two. One. Lay down. You should feel that in your back. It should feel really good. You've been warming up all through the class to get to these spine postures. The deepest back bend, the deepest forward bend, compression in your spine, extension in the spine, bringing back a normal range of motion, keeping your spine nice, juicy, flexible. Flex your feet, toes and heels together, arms and the head. Hands palms face the ceiling, chin to your chest, inhale, sit up. Exhale, quick, grab your toes and blow it out. Good, turn around. Second set, come back to the top, the middle of the mat, sit down Japanese style, hips on your heels. Ready? Inhale, arms up over your head, hands, palms together, chin up, and you go down. Look forward and stretch forward. We're getting more and more on YouTube Live. So happy, forehead on the floor. Little baby fingers stretch before the rest of your arms in the air. Shoulder blades back, those coming out of the body, breathe. Shoulders are supposed to hurt, breathe. Stretch your arms forward, stretch your hips back. Body stretching in opposite directions. If you're not feeling anything, you're not doing anything. Uh huh. So use your arms, stretch. Stretch your hips back towards the back of the window, stomach in, stretch and stretch. Give me one more stretch forward, mold. Slowly come up. All the way, good. Exhale, arms down by your side. Beautiful, stand up on the knees. This time, if your back was killing you, you can go ahead and do a little bit wider, eight to 10 inches between the knees. Still only six inches between the feet. Hands on your hips. Hands are in your imaginary dream body as they're facing down. Hips forward, drop your head back. You can stay right there. You don't have to go any further than that. Just let the head hang heavy. When you're ready, go back halfway and stop in the middle. Do the left hand first if you're ready. Right hand down. You don't have to grab your feet. You can keep your hands on your hips. Take a deep breath, push. I mean, let it sit to everything for Keep pushing. Push, push, push. The downward reach and the downward option. Head back. Relax your head, your neck, breathe. Keep your eyes open, close your mouth. Keep looking back. Look for where the wall meets the floor. Keep looking where the floor comes up to your mat. Push your hands into your feet. Open the chest. All the love coming out of your chest. Hips forward. Three big pushes. Push and push. Take a deep breath. Hips forward. Move. Push your hands on your hips. Come up slowly. Stop in the middle. Very nice. Very good one. Oh, we needed that. Flip the top corner over your heels. Get a nice dry grip. Thumbs on the outside, fingers on the inside. Pull on your heels. Take it easy. Chin to your chest. Stomach in. Go down. Vertebra. By vertebra, round your spine. Touch your forehead on the floor. Little baby, touch the forehead on the floor. Grab your heels. Lift your hips up. Walk your head knees in one by one. Close out the gap between the knees and the forehead. Make sure it's the top of the head on the floor. Make sure you're not rolling to the back of the head. Breathe. Shoulders up toward the ceiling. Breathe. 
where your heels close together. Do me a favor, push the tops of your feet down towards the floor. There you go, more of a stretch. Shoulders up toward the ceiling. Take a deep breath, stomach and hips up one more time. Grab your heels, move the arms only. Arms are doing all the work here, Dan. No momentum, head comes up, labs. There you go, grip, flip out the tail. And relax, three, two, Should be feeling really good right about now. I hope so. I became a yoga teacher because doing this yoga made me feel so good that I wanted to make you feel good. If I can make you feel good for an hour out of your day, take your mind off whatever's bothering you, then I did my job. Flex your feet, toes and heels together, arms to the head, chin to your chest, inhale, sit up. Go, blow it out. All right. Sit face in the front of the space, right leg off corner wise, bend your left leg. Create pressure with the foot against the inner thigh, bicep, two legs look like an L. You can always keep this leg straight, mom, if you're still here, you don't have to bend this knee. Bring your arms up over your head, turn to the right, grab your foot. Ten fingers in our lock position, pull on the toes, heel in the air. If you need to bend the knee, grab the foot, you do that. Tuck your chin to your chest, just like grab it, touch your forehead on the knee, bend the knee if you need to. Bend your elbows down, left shoulder down, left elbow down, roll into the left. Left knee on the floor, left hip on the floor, roll in. Suck in your stomach, bring your forehead higher for the compression. Quick, if you lock your knee and standing head to knee, lift up your heel, toes toward your face, lock your knee. Okay, come up. Did you feel that? Ah, yeah, I got a cramp. Switch the legs, left leg out, right leg in, bring your arms up, over your head, turn to the left, grab your foot. Heel off the floor, maybe. There you go, knee chin. Tuck your chin to your chest. Bend the knee if you need to to grab the foot. Bend the knee if you need to to get the forehead on the knee. Bend your elbows down. Elbows down, nice Kimberly. Roll into the right. Right knee down. Right hip on the floor. Stomach in. Toes toward your face. Get more of a compression. Forehead higher. Lift up your heel. Try to lock your knee. Change. Come up. Good. Both legs out in front of you. Lie down on your back. Soon as you hit the floor, inhale. Sit up. Go. Blow it out. Grab your big toes, middle and index finger, right where your flip flop would go. Walk your hips back, right, left, right, left. Right, left, right, left. Come on, shoku, finish strong. Get off the sits bones, onto the hamstrings. Pull. Pull on the toes. If your legs are bending, work on getting them straight. If they're straight, you go. Bend your elbows down. Pull, pull, pull from the lower spine. Look at the toes. Body go through your eyes, go stomach to the thighs, chest to the knees. Pull more. Shoulders back more. Stretch your head forward, Alex. Stretch your neck. Lift your heels off the floor. Heels up, Meechan and Helen. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Try to touch your forehead to your toes. Stretch, Kristen. Okay, come up. Good. Arms to the head, chin to your chest, inhale. Sit up, go, blow it out. Quarter turn to the left. Ardhamatsi and Jasana, final spine twist. Bend the left leg. Bring your right leg over, right heel touching with your knee. Two hips sitting comfortably on the floor. Left arm up, bring it over the leg. Grab the knee in front, look down. Three things, knee hand to heel, one spot. You can keep the right hand at the base of the spine or bring it around, whatever's good for you. Lift your chest up, turn twist. Twist and twist and twist, each and every vertebra turning and twisting. Use your eyes, body goes your eyes, go inhale, stretch up. Exhale, twist and twist a little bit more. Look at the back corner, twist one more time. Change, untwist, bringing your spine to the neutral position, switch your legs, bend your right leg, left leg over. You can always keep this right leg straight, mom, if you need to. Right arm up, bring it over the leg, grab the knee, look down, three things, your knee, your hand, your heel should all be in one spot. Hand at the base of the spine, we'll bring it around your turn twist. Each and every vertebra turning and twisting strands of a pearl necklace. Inhale, stretch out. Exhale, twist. Right shoulder back, left shoulder, shoulder forward. Look over the left shoulder, front corner, twist and twist. Give me one more, twist one more time. Change, untwist. Lay down your back. You made it. Congratulations. Wonderful Friday yoga. You have a wonderful rest of the day, wonderful weekend. Set the tone for your weekend. Final sit of the day. Give me the best one. Flex your feet, toes and heels together. Arms to the head, chin to your chest. Inhale, sit up. Exhale, quick. Blow it out. Very nice. It is 9.58. So let's just do one set. One set, you're blowing out all the toxins you didn't get to sweat out. Your belly's going in and out, in and out. Looks like this. If you can't sit down Japanese style, you can sit Indian style, you can keep your legs straight, whatever it is you need. Relax the belly, big Buddha belly, nobody's looking, relax the jaw, let your lips swallow a couple of times. We'll start slow and we'll speed up two times. Begin.
little bit quicker. Now, fast as you can. Last 10. 3, 2, 1. Nice job, everybody. Give yourself a hand. Pat on the back. I'm going to kiss. Mwah. Happy Friday. Thank you for joining me. Turn around and lie down on your back. Relax. I will see you again Sunday, Monday, 9 a.m. Pacific. Please share this with your friends. It is also on the YouTube Live. I think we'll keep doing that. You can watch the recording anytime on the YouTube Live. Open your arms, your legs. Take your tongue off your, your mouth, wiggle your jaw around. Let your eyes go back into your head. Three deep inhales and exhale. Ready? One, inhale. Exhale. Inhale, two. Exhale. Last one, inhale.